Hello developers, welcome to React Tailwind. In this channel, you can find everything about React and Tailwind CSS. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to set up Tailwind CSS project from scratch. This is absolutely for beginners. Okay, let's start the project. First of all guys, I want to talk about the software that you need to install in your computer. The first software that you need to install in your computer is Visual Studio Code. Open your browser and go to this link code.visualstudio.com Download it and install it in your computer. The second software that you need to install Node.js in your computer. Go to nodejs.org and click on the latest version of the Node.js. Download it and install it. The process of installation is very simple. Just click next, next, next until it's done. The next step is installing Tailwind CSS in your computer. Go to tailwindcss.com and click on the get started button. It will tell you how to install Tailwind CSS by using Tailwind CLI tool. You need to run this command in your computer. Okay, I'm creating a new folder. Call it Tailwind CSS. Open this folder inside your Visual Studio Code. Go to terminal and create new terminal. Now inside terminal, I'm going to create a package.json file. Right in the terminal, npm init. After that, click enter, 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 just enter until it is done. Now it's time to install Tailwind CSS in our project. Go to tailwindcss.com and copy this command. Ctrl C. Paste it here. It will download and install Tailwind dev dependencies. It takes some time to install. Please be wait. Tailwind CSS and its dev dependencies are installed. If you go to packet.json, now go to Tailwind documentation and copy this command. Paste it in the terminal. It will create Tailwind config.js. See? It creates Tailwind config.js. The next step is to configure your template paths. You have to specify your HTML paths by copying this command. Control C. Open Tailwind config and paste it in here. For me, I'm going to change uh, the HTML paths. In here, I'm going to create a new folder. Call it this. Inside this folder, I'm going to create index.html. Now I should replace src to this. The next step is to add Tailwind directives in your CSS. Copy these directives. Make it a new folder. src. It should be inside src. Create a new file. Input.css. Paste the directives inside the input CSS. The next step, guys, is you have to run this command inside your terminal. What this command does? It takes input CSS from source folder and compile it in output.css. It will create a file inside our disk folder by the name of output.css. Run this command. See guys, it create output.css. You have to link this output CSS inside your index.html. Doc. Now I want to link that. Output.css. Now I'm gonna add some classes. Hello world. 
Tolwin, Mrs. Add some classes. Make it. Make it for Excel. Make the text to blue. And BG to red. If you want to this suggestion, you have to install Tailwind IntelliSense. Go to extension and install Tailwind IntelliSense. You have to install this extension. Now I'm gonna save this. Double click in the index.html. You have to open it with live server. If you don't have live server, you have to install it. It's an extension. Right, live server. This is live server. Okay, guys, I want to open it with live server to see. See, our Tailwind CSS is installed successfully. If you stop the project, guys, every time you have to run this command. It is hard to memorize that, so I'm gonna fix it. Copy this command. Copy this. Go to package.json. In the script, write dev. And paste that command. And instead of npx, I'm gonna use npm. I forgot to add comma here. Save it. Now inside terminal, I'm gonna type npm run dev. It will run our project. Now open, open it with live server. Let's add some classes. Eg. Right. I want to add some more classes, font bold, and I want to change the text color to white. Right. Text color to white. Hello world. This was the installation of Tilwin CSS guys. Thank you for watching. If you have any question, please comment down below. See you in the next video.